Welcome back to my little channel. Today I once again will address feminism. Now feminism is a really really strange ideology which makes women say the darndest of things. Well men too, mind you, not all feminists are women. Most women are not feminists, most men are not feminists, but the ones that are say the stupidest things. Now I'm sure you uh, know a few examples but I'm going to give you this one and please don't go harass this person on Twitter then again maybe I should get off of Twitter anyway because my god how that platform has um... never mind men if DNA confirms the baby is not yours it doesn't change the fact that you must take responsibility of the baby women go through a lot in marriages women deserve better yeah let that sink in for a moment. So as a husband or partner, you must take care of a child that isn't yours. Not, would you be as kind to take care of the child that isn't yours? No, no, you must. How dare you consider yourself not obligated to do so. Now, personally, I would say what you could also do is say, yeah, I'm, I'm sorry, you cheated on me, Bye bye Something women can do when a man cheats on them as well, let's be honest. And uh, if you get a divorce as a woman and you have children with this man, then the fact that he cheated on you is reason for you to get alimony. Therefore, the man would still be financially responsible for your children, because they're also his children. Which makes perfect sense. But how does it make sense that a man would be financially responsible for children that are not his? Now don't get me wrong, there are plenty of examples where men take care of children that aren't theirs and it's an honorable thing to do. After all, there are women that had a divorce, they had children and then they got married again, so the new partner is not the original father of the kids. Fair enough, he's still going to take care of them. It's a uh, you know, it's, it's a good thing, applaudable even, but it's a choice. And according to Quinn Vivian, that choice is something that man shouldn't have. How dare you not choose to take responsibility for the action of a woman? Oh. See, it must be me, but I seriously believe that um, if men and women are equal, the responsibilities of men and women should be equal too. Now again, don't harass Vivian. I mean, I don't think she's a... I think she's a kid. She might not even reach double... Uh, well, no, she does double, double digits. She didn't reach her 20s yet. I wanted to say double digits, but 10 is double digits too, so... And if she did reach 20, I mean, she's the product of an idiotic education system, so don't blame her too much. But let's scoff her, let's make fun of her a bit amongst one another, and know that this is how certain feminists think. Now, obviously, hashtag not all, so before anyone says that's not what real feminism say, yeah, it is but most of them are smart enough not to say it out in public. And I agree with you on that one. Most feminists don't say it out in public. They might still think it, though. And it's the mindset that is the problem. Anyway, criticism, as always, is more than welcome. Like, share and subscribe if you feel so inclined. Look at the beautiful bunnies, because... Bunnies, let's be honest. And I hope to see you all next time.